Hello everybody, welcome to another Tim's Cards and Comics video. And look at this, we have today a World's Greatest Card Chase Pack Edition Baseball of the 1940s. This is 2013, 2013, I got three of these, I'm going to be opening one of them today. You get 16 packs, which are almost all of them are going to be junk packs. I doubt you're going to get anything like that Babe Ruth thing or, or any of these other ones there, but you never know. Who can... Who knows what's going to come out of these. Probably all those good cards have been... Uh, we'll talk about it in just a second. So I was going to say that probably all those good cards, if there was ever, ever, ever any of those in the packs, in the boxes, they've probably all been pulled from over the last seven years. Let's see what we're gonna get out of these. Look at that. We're already starting out with, like I said, most of these are gonna be junk here. There is a, I think that was 1991 Donruss. I'm not expecting anything real great out of these. It's just, you never know. Something fun. There's a 1988 with a piece of gum in it. I'm not gonna chew it. And a 1989 with some gum in it. Oh, oh wait a minute. Oh, there he is. Oh no. Alright, those are the only two that done. That side looks like we got a lot of foil packs on one side, a lot of wax on the other. Let's pull these waxes out. I know. Alright, let's do it this way. There we go. That's better. Alright, let's see what we got. We'll go along here. Alright, there's a nice one there. 1989 Fleer. Good chance. A good chance. You get a chance at a Griffey rookie card. I say a good chance, but you get a chance at a Griffey rookie. Uh, I can't remember if this is 89. 88 or 89 Don Russ, whichever. I don't know. There's another 89 Tops. Fortunately, the Tops didn't have that rookie in it. 1990 Fleer. Uh, what's this? 19 something else. 1988 Fleer. That's kind of cool. And then we got a 1992. Leaf Series 1, or Donruss Series 1, excuse me. No, I said Leaf, but it's Donruss Series 1. And, okay, now we're getting a little bit more recent. 2007 Future Stars Baseball. That's kind of cool. I like those newer ones. That. Uh, oh, my God, no. Big baseball cards. Oh, I hate those. They're too big. All right, there's your Leaf, 1991 Leaf Series 2. And, oh, nice. 2010 Series 2 tops. The blue back inserts, yeah. We're lucky. Oh, gosh, no, no, 1990 score. What a bore. And, yep, nothing special. A couple upper deck packs, 1990 and 1991. So, there we go. I'm going to put our box back up there. Like I said, basically the world's greatest car chase is the world's greatest ripoff. Because you've probably got more chance of getting struck by lightning and uh, whatever than you do of ever getting one of those really good cards out of these things. Like I said, you, if you're lucky, you might get that King Griffey Jr. rookie out of that. We're going to leave our newer cards for last, and that 1989. I don't know if it really makes any difference which way we go with these. I like the 88s, 1990s. I, yeah, I guess they're all right. We'll leave the Fleers last, I guess. I think we're going to open these couple of crappy Donruss and the Score one first. And, oh, I don't know. Let's just do it this way. Get them over here. 16 packs. I'll try to go through these as fast as possible, which means it's going to take me about an hour. No, no, no. It's already taken five minutes just to show you what's in the things. Here we go. All right, what was that? Okay, 1989. That's what I thought. Oh, nice. Barry Bonds. Not bad. John Crook, Eric Davis, Bedrosian, Mike Scott, Ozzy Smith, Melito Perez. Wally Joyner, Ruben Sierra, Steve Searcy, 
Uh, yeah, you could, there is a uh, King Griffey Jr. rookie in these, too. Be real lucky, but. Uh, Canseco, Frank White, and Alfredo Griffin. All right, so we picked the Barry Bonds out of that. Not bad for that one. All right, I think this was 90, 91 or 90 or something. I don't know. It's hard for me to remember these. I open these up every once in a while. And Look, these are the opening packages, right? Look at that. <laughs> Too bad for that wrapper. All right, yeah, these are 1990s. Sorry about that. 1990 Donruss. We already knew that, right? Let's kind of do this like this a little bit. Okay, the Wade Boggs All-Star. There were some errors in these things, but I'm not going to stop and figure out if these are the errors or not. Because they just take all day. I'm not going to name all these names. If I don't have to, I might name a few. There's a... Ed Woodson, Diamond King, Romanski, Bradley Russell, and two more jobbers. All right, nothing in that pack. Let's do this 19, what did I say? That was 1990 score. I remember going to our Kmart and trying to grab all the scores up there, and I came out and It's this year, the first, I think it was the first season they were out that we did that. Uh, they had all different kinds of packaging and whatnot. And tried to grab a bunch of stuff up there. Rick Mailer, Vance Law. I'm still trying to do it that way, but it don't work. Vance Law, Mike Flanagan, Michael Lacoste. Oh man, this one's, this one pack must have been dropped on its corner. They got dinged up corners. Really bad. There we go. There's that guy. There's that stupid thing. There's a Ryan Sandberg. Just land. RJ Reynolds. RJ Reynolds. That guy. That guy. Yeah, all these guys. There's nothing in those. Alright. Oh. I just like big cards because they're too big, but we'll open this one anyway. I don't know. I, can't, I don't know what year this is. Okay. Just a second. Okay, these are 1989. Let's see. We'll start out good with Don Maddenly. That's all right. Terry Leach. These are ugly cards, though. Todd Burns. Mark McLemore. I don't know who decided to do. Rock Reigns. That's not Tim Reigns. It's Rock Reigns. And Chuck Finley. All right. Not mentally out of that one. Could have been worse. All right, let's go to a couple of the 89. Is that 89 tops? Got two 89 tops. All right, there's a nice wax stain card on the back. Way box. It looks like. Oh, there's a piece of gum and it's intact. It looks new. No, I'm not gonna eat that mold. Okay, ick, ick, ick. Oh my God! Look what happened to that card. <laughs> Yeah, that's probably what it is. It's probably not mold. It's probably cardboard on it. Mold. Got the mold. Yeah, right. Okay, never mind. Greg Gross, Tom Herr, Johnny Paredes, Tom Glavin. What are these cards must have been. These cards are all dinged up, too. I don't know if this box got dinged up or if somebody dropped all these cards on the corners or what. Darren Dalton, Arthur Griffin. That thing there, Gary Farshall, this guy. If there's anything worse than mint condition junk cards, it's dinged up junk cards and ones with big gum stains. <laughs> okay, well, that was not too good. Alright, here's another. Oh my goodness, that gum was busted. Too bad, Gary. Goodbye. And oh god, I thought that other one is Daryl Strawberry. Horrible looking gum stain on the card. Alright, Greg Swindle, Gary Carter, Hall of Famer, Louis Asia, Craig Reynolds, Alan Trammell, Jeff Reardon, Company Something or Other, expired for 30 years, John Shelby, Rock Reigns again. That's when they were calling him Rock in the cards. If you smell what the Rock Reigns is cooking! Keith Miller? 
Two sacks, stay veiled, come back, stay tubes. Oh my. Oh my. This is the typical world's greatest car chase box, ladies and gentlemen. If you ever want to buy one, I'll show you. This is a public service announcement, or whatever you want to call it there. You decide if you really want one or not. You want to come up with a lot of. Oh, there's Greg Maddox. I guess, I don't know if that's his first Topps card or whatever. I don't know. Dow, Wathen, Cecil Fielder. Woohoo! I've got about a million of that anyway. Daryl, that guy. That stupid thing there. This guy's standing on their heads. Terry McGriff. Mc Terry McGriff? And in relation to Fred, I don't know. Jesse Barfield, Gary Reedus, Jim Padalinik, Doc Edwards. I'm going to need a Doc after this mess. Bill, I'm not guy. All right, well, we got a Greg Maddox, which I might to pay for that pack, I don't know. All right, what do we got here? 1990 Upper Deck. Anything in a good 1990 Upper Deck? Probably not. Why, the reason why I say these are the greatest ripoffs is because they rarely ever have anything any good in any packs that are really anything. They just... But occasionally you get a good Barry Bonds card. Not bad. Except for Natus. I mean, you can pick out... It's not like you're not going to get any stars, necessarily. You just... You get something that's really... I doubt you're going to get anything that's really... super great out of these. Some of the cheaper rookie cards and whatnot. But all the packs are, like I say, these old junk here ones. Ken Caminiti, I don't remember what his... I don't think that's his rookie, though. All right, so we got a Barry Bonds out of that one. Oops, whoops. You got a better chance of getting something decent out of those newer cards. And there's only two packs of newer cards. In there. You may still get your in, good insert or... Something really good. Who knows? What is this again? 1991? It's 91. <coughs> was it 90 or 91 for Sammy Sosa rookie? I don't remember. Pasquale Perez. Henry Hensley Mullins. Scott Lewis. Mark Williamson. Todd Burns. Terry Pendleton. Oh, 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 oh. What's this? Oh, cool. Baseball Heroes of Nolan Ryan. Now that's cool. You can get some cool cards over there. Kim Gross, Chuck Krim, Steve Howard, Tim Burke. Tim Burke! <laughs> Third stand back. You never know when I'm going to yell something stupid. The Detroit Tiger hologram! Oh, yeah. Rah, 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 rah. Whoopee. Steve Staten and Orlando Merced. All right. Well, we got Nolan Ryan out of that one. Put that one in the good pile. I guess I could put that Greg Maddox over there. I think that was worth a dollar near mint. The mint. All right, what's this? 1990 something or other. 1991 Leaf Series 2. Uh oh. Ooh, look at that. Oil. Puzzle piece. Ooh. All right, Andy Van Slyke. Gary Gaetti, Alex Fernandez, Mark Lewis, Shaw, Palmero, McDowell, White Somebody, Moss, Jeff Coat, Sampin, Hill, and those two. Oh, they're dud. Oh, we'll get you done with this one pretty soon. There's a Donruss one, whatever year I said that was. 1992, Series 1 of them. Okay. Let's see what they look like. Oh, they're stupid puzzle pieces. something. There's a blue something back there. No, it's a Diamond King. All right, well, let's we'll see what that is. Rick Cerrone, Eddie Dabonensky, Ricky Rookie, Kevin Morton, Brent Smith, Charles Nagy, Wayne Ward, Ricky Henderson, the Lancaster, Scott Bales, Langford, Daniels, Rimmel, Juan Gonzalez, Brian McRae, and our 
Diamond King is Paul Molitor. That's cool. That should be a good one. Not real great, but kind of cool. Yeah, we'll put that one over in a good pile here. I have a hard time recapping. I have to dig through all those cards over. There. Oh, no, wet stain on the Fleer. What year was this? 1988. All right, 1988. Will we love it or hate? Baseball stickers. Never mind for those. Dale Swain, Dale Murphy, Dave Hingle, Spire, Lemon, 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 Hudson, Gerhardt, Ralph Bryant, oh, come on, Ralph. Tony Phillips, Hubie Brooks, Kevin Seitzer, Tom Ronnie, Jose Guzman. Mookie Wilson and Wally Joyner. All right, well, that was staying. All right, what's this one? 1990 Fleer. And we got three more. What should be our three best packs coming up. I don't mean we're going to get anything good out of those packs, but... Uh, 1990 Linton, Gardner, Lancaster, Brock, Petrie, Aquilera, Damon Berryhill, C. Jones, Benito Santiago, and what do we have here? Bobby Rose, rookie, Mike Hartley, Bobby Rose, whoever he was. Not Pete Rose, Bobby Rose. No relation. All right, well, let's into that one. Nothing in that. Hopefully these cards ain't dinged up in these ones, because those other packs have all the dings on them. It's not cool, I mean. That's why nobody's buying these. I don't know. Okay, here we go. I like this design. Sort of. Paul O'Neill. Steve Peters. Tom Candiati. Terry Leach. Joe Ursulak. Carmel. Oh, they are dinged up. What the heck is going on here? This whole bunch of cards is dinged up. Don Mattingly. The dinged up corner. Mike Schmidt. Oh, look at that. That ticks me off. There's no way that they could have dinged them up in the package, like in the box, during the shipment or anything like that. These had to have been dinged up before they even put them in there. All right, let's hope for the best for these newer cars. Future Stars Baseball, Upper Deck 2007. Look real quick and see what we can see with corner damage. The first guy's Justin Morneau. Well, that looks about typical of a pack like that. Justin Morneau. Can't read these names. Aramis Ramirez. I don't know who's the Scott Scott Bolin. Eric Chavez. That's it. Then we get five cards. Four, one, two, three, four cards. Is that how many we're supposed to have? I don't know. Oh, yeah, four cards. Four card pack. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure whether any of those are rookies or not. All right, 2010. Tops. Let's see if we get some familiar names in this one. Let's see if they're dinged up. Miguel Olivio. Checking this before we even get started here to see how, if the corners are messed up. Looks like we have something. Ooh, we have something right there, whatever that is. Woohoo! Maybe it's something cool. It ain't dinged up. All right, let's get, all right, Aaron Cunningham. Travis Snyder. Ooh, what do we have here? Tony Perez and, J and Johnny Bench. Franchise history. It's just a regular card. It's, oh, it's a Cincinnati Reds leaders type thing. A.J. Burnett. Uh, Ryan Sweeney. Lastings Millage. And the Yankees team card. And this looks, what is this? A turkey red or something like that? 
prominent baseball players. Kurt Suzuki, Turkey Red Card. That's kind of cool. And then we have a Matt Kemp, Tops Attack Cold Card. Those usually are worth a couple bucks. Uh, Carlos Beltran, Carlos Quinton, and Miguel Olivo. All right, so we really didn't get much in this box. Got these couple of cards here that kind of neat. Uh, really didn't get anything. I don't know about these future stars. We didn't get that for sure. I didn't expect it really. I was hoping for something better. Uh, we got the Paul Molitor Diamond King. It's kind of cool. We got the Nolan Ryan Baseball Heroes card. A couple of Barry Bonds cards in the other packs, and that is it. All right. So let me know below what you think about this one. I got two more of these guys to open up in the future. I'm going to open something else up there in the next box. Kind of bounce things around a little bit here so we don't get all these right in a row. So we'll see you again next time. So long for now. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, and we'll see you again next time. Goodbye.